This piece is titled Oil Trace. It was made in 2016. It's got a height of 35 centimeters, a width of 25 centimeters, and a four and a half centimeter depth. <clears throat> I, as I said, I made it in 2016. It was on my first year of my MA. And it was the first real idea when I was really thinking about this whole idea of mixing pre-used building materials with art supplies. The surface is canvas, and it was an old piece of canvas that was on the building site, used for, you know, drying brushes, wiping tra uh, trowels, um, and so so I took that as a surface, thinking it as a as a art supply as well. And I created this mixture of paraffin wax, which is like a candle wax, and oil pastels, melted them in together. And when you put oil pastels with wax, it naturally, that, that colour of the oil pastel naturally melts down in with the wax. I took the canvas and dunked it in. So it's its first idea as well when I was using this technique, which I'd like to term the dunking technique. And then when I drew it out of the surface, you get all these lovely raised creases um, and uh, the oil pastels really set nicely onto the, onto the canvas, almost kind of giving this rainbow effect. And then what I did, it was this first idea again of kind of mapping into the surface. So all these black lines are um, acrylic um, and the acrylic is where I'm, you know, informing what's happened to the surface. So as I say, it's a, it's a, it's a mix of paraffin wax, oil pastels, acrylic on canvas. And then when, when you think about wax, obviously it's a temporal substance. So to set it, what I use, I use an industrial gloss, which is like a resin. So now it's a solid form. It's like a plastic. So it's um, the wax will never melt. You know, it's there, it's a solid form. And I like to see this piece as a, as a small sculptural painting like an ornament, like something that, as I say, I wouldn't see this as a hanging piece, I would see it as a ground piece. Um, so yeah, that's oil trace.